these games against Missouri? Uh, I'm not really desperate. I really want it, though. You know, it's one of the big games that we play every year that we really look forward to. And obviously, we haven't won this one yet, so it'd be great to get this one. Sure. Obviously, every year this game is good, but do you feel like there's a little bit more of a buzz around it with both teams being top 15 and then having out the great starts? Yeah, no doubt. You know, obviously, you know, it's a great game to play in every year with an incredible atmosphere. And uh, they're a good team. You know, talented. They're well coached. And, you know, we look forward for the challenge. With these guards, what is the challenge? Are these some of the best guards you played? Yeah, you know, I played against Phil Presley the last couple of years. You know, I played with him when I was in high school at the uh, NBA Top 100 camp. Um, and he just, he's obviously hard to guard. He's, just, he's so talented and quick. Uh, you know, we're just going to have to come out and compete and play every uh, possession. There's a bunch of new faces as the guards, too. You guys are used to Kim English and all yeah. those guys. Uh, what have you noticed from the new guys? Um, you know, they're good players. You know, they obviously came they came to Missouri to compete. Uh, but they, they've only got two guys that have played in this game. So, I mean, that's something that we can try to use to our advantage. But, you know, they're not going to just come in and hand us a trophy. So we're going to have to come in and play hard every possession. Coach Gross has one of his big challenges is keeping you guys from getting overhyped for this game. Mm-hmm. Obviously, with the losses you guys have sustained the last few years, how do you guys control that as players? Um, uh, we just got to be mentally strong and uh, we got to be mature. You know, we have a pretty solid team, you know, when it comes to maturity-wise. You know, we got a, a bunch of seniors, uh, sophomores, and we only got one freshman. So, you know, we're looking for everybody to con- contribute. Um, we're going to come out and with a lot of energy and uh, we're going to play hard. Is it really different from your perspective? Is it the, the whole what do you mean yellow this? and orange divided huge arena? Does it seem like a regular game to you or does it... Um, to the hype. You know, you try to prepare for every game the same. You know, you you want to come in every opponent and be like, you know, this is this is a great this is a great game to be in. But you know, these, these types of games, you know, you really get up for. You know, no matter what anybody says, you know, it's a lot different. You know, you go in there and you got half Missouri fans, half U of I fans. So it's obviously an incredible atmosphere. It's a it's a blessing to get a chance to play in this every year. Um, well, you know, he when he was over at Xavier, I know he played with uh, that in uh, Cincinnati. So, you know, he's he's got a lot of uh, these types of games under, under his belt as well. So, I know I know he's a smart guy. He knows what he's getting into, and um, we just want to be prepared and uh, go out there and compete. Coach was talking about rebounding as an importance. How much of a you know onus do you put on the guards you know, more than the bigs for you guys to, to help them rebound? Um, you know, we gotta help them every game. It's not just these you know types of games with other teams. You know, great. Uh, Rebounding wise, you know, I think they're like top three in the nation rebounding wise. And, uh, you know, me, DJ, Joe, Tracy, we, we gotta we gotta come up, step up, we gotta box out. And, uh, you know, Nana, uh, Tri- uh, Tyler, Mike Henry, Sam, and all them, they're gonna have their hands full with Oriaki and all those uh, big guys in there. You know, Lawrence Bowers, he had to set out last year with his injury, and uh, I know he's gonna be, he's definitely pumped for this game. So we gotta do all we can to help them rebound. You guys shot 50 percent on Sunday, but from three, a little colder than usual. Mm-hmm. Done anything to address that this week? Um, no, we we practice hard every day. You know, we come in and shoot, get shots up. Uh, our shots just wasn't falling. And uh, when days like that happen, we gotta we gotta pick it up on different ends. And uh, we can't always rely on our three point shot. Uh, it might seem like that now, but you know, we gotta do better job getting to the basket, get to the free throw line. And uh, I think uh, this game, you know, we're gonna have to pull out all the stops for this one.